You will pay. Dial 3 now. Thank you for using NCI. Go ahead. Hello? Hi. Hi. Hey, I'm gonna grab my cigarette here. Don't talk like that. <laughs> Can't have them here. <laughs> um... Why don't you kind of tell me, um... Nobody's ever talked to you about this, huh? No, uh. Hmm. Wouldn't you think they talked to the people that heard it before they talked to him? Yeah, that's what I would think. That's kind of weird. How did, how did this come about, Kevin? Well, <clears throat> Bill was talking about this guy that was over there, and we were out on the yard. And this dude, they, they call him Red, which is real, his, his name's Richard, but everybody calls him Red. Okay. And he was out there talking to some some guys about some stuff <clears throat> that I'd never heard about. Then he come up and I was talking to Bill and he said something about uh, Jacob. Uh-huh. And then I heard about, this was a while back, like 12 years ago, when this Jacob got kidnapped. That was about nine years ago. Nine years ago? Uh-huh. I knew it was a while back. Yeah. And he started talking about it with uh, Bill. I was standing there listening. About how him and his brother, and he said some other people too, but he didn't give no names or nothing. <laughs> he just kid up to his sister's apartment and tortured him for a few days. He said there was other people there? Yeah. At the abduction or at the sister's apartment? At the sister's apartment. Hmm. brother. Yeah, and see, Bill called me. He told me that Richard said that him, his brother, and his sister were all in on it. Right, yeah. It's about him, his sister tied up, tied the little kid up. Yeah? Yeah. Oh, the sister tied him up? Yeah, was the one that tied him up in, in her apartment. So I guess it's all happened in his apartment for a while. Hmm. See, I thought, I thought his sister told me the police came there the next day and asked where his, her brother was the night Jacob was taken. Now it makes me wonder if they even did. Exactly. Before when I was talking to you, you said you think something was really wrong here. What are you talking about? Well, it's, yeah, I mean, dude, he, he's being too open about it. I mean, he's, he's told a lot of people a lot of different things up in here. And it's, you know, if, if, uh, if this guy didn't commit this crime, how does he know so many details? And why is he being, being so open with it? I mean, he's just going around telling strangers he don't even know. Then he's bringing in his brother and his sister. You think he is that because he needs to talk about it? I think he's trying to get it off his chest. Boy, he sure must lie when the authorities come up there then. <laughs>